Hello and welcome back everyone to some more Spyro 3. So today we're going to go into Sergeant Bird's base. I have to train the hummingbirds. They must be in peak physical condition if we're going to take on the sorceress. Sir. The situation is this. Yesterday, at 18.45 hours, the Rhinox invaded. We defended as best we could, sir, but without your leadership, we didn't put up an effective resistance. By 1900 hours, the rest of the squad was captured and the Rhinox had complete control of the base. Well, that doesn't sound too good. I'm guessing we've been away too long. Well, fuck you! Oh yeah, oh I miss playing a silent bird, a sergeant bird, I was about to say silent bird, I was like what? Alright, so all we gotta do really in this is just rescue all the five birds and I believe that's about the only objective we do have. Ladybirds obviously give you uh, the sparks' as health back there, and you know the best thing about sergeant bird that you Spyro can't really do? Thank you sir. Is that he can fly bitches? He can fly! But yeah, I think you have to constantly be tapping X, otherwise he just falls back down again. So that's kind of a disappointment, but, you know, at least he can actually fly. There is a way of getting out of here. I think it's this way. I can't remember exactly how you do it. But no, I love being Sergeant Bird because of, like, his rockets and everything. And, like, his theme isn't even that, like, it's not even that good, but it is good for him. Like, it suits him. It suits his character and everything. A 25 gem already? Jesus! Okay, so you can't actually blow up them just yet. I think you actually do need some kind of, like, rocket or something to, to power that, but... I'm not 100% certain on that. Okay, let's get the butterfly catcher. Or in this case, penguin catcher. But this is what we're basically going to be doing in um, Haunted Towers back there. For those who don't know. Get out of it! Get out of it! There you go. I actually like all these little side character mission bits. Like, they're really quite cool. Like, in just terms of, like... Because we've never really had this before in terms of Spyro game. This was, like, the first Spyro game to actually do anything like that. Sir, I've captured the enemy Russians. They won't march far on an empty stomach. Sir, the Rhinox have blocked the way out of this next cave with a security door, and I don't think you'll be able to blast your way through this one. Recommend you land on the weights and carry them to the pressure-sensitive security switches either side of the door. When in position, press the square button to drop the weight. Press the triangle button once to look down, press it again to look up, sir. I see... Well, let's blast a couple of these guys first. I think these are like heat-seeking rocket missiles or something. Like, if you don't fire them exactly on, that doesn't matter because it will seek the uh, it will seek the enemy out anyway. Like, regardless. All right. Well, we will go down there in a second, but I want to collect a couple of gems first. And also those moles that you saw back in the other room. I was trying to like fire something at them there. But in terms of the moles, I think that you get something at the end where like you get this little bombing thing that you can hold on to. And it will, um, well, it will destroy the moles, basically. Because there's no way, they're too quick, so there's no way you're going to be able to hit them with just your rockets. So you are actually going to have to do it a different, like, a little bit of a different way. Did I just see a gem here somewhere? Yeah, there it is. I thought I saw it. And there's a guy up here guarding a couple of gems, you little bastard. Alright, so let's go and get, wait, what? I thought I blasted her out of that cage. What the hell happened? You're free, go! What the hell are you doing, woman? Oh, there you go. Why wouldn't it open before then? Maybe I'm not hitting the right part. Alright, let's see. Where's the... What the hell? Alright, here we go. Here's the weights. Alright, alright, let's see. Is this gonna work? Oh, no, 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 no. Keep going, keep going. A little further. There you go. Well, that worked. And then this one. Last one. Alright, here we go. I could just drop it on the mole, but then I don't think that would work. 
All right, one more. Little further. Little further. That's it. Drop it. Nice. I love how like the door doesn't even open. It just explodes when you put on the right. It's like, yeah, that's how they designed it. You were only supposed to blow the bloody doors off. If any of you get that reference, I love you. Oh my god. I do reference things sometimes, but most of the time I don't watch enough movies to reference from, so it doesn't really matter anyway. I see a little gem thing up there, which I just smashed. Is there any more? I could have swore, like, in this level, I swear there's, like, more stuff up towards, like, the skies than there is down. Because I used to miss so much stuff by going... Ah, I got you, you little bastard. I used to miss so much stuff by going, like, just staying on the ground. I would never go and fly up anywhere. Which is kind of stupid, really, because that's what Sergeant Bird is meant for, but... I don't know, I mean, I would miss everything. But now, I, w I actually love flying up, so... Alright, I need a ladybird, where are you? There you go, alright, Sparks, have a good meal. Any more information? Doc? Nothing? Oh, missiles! Well, that's interesting. They look like bombing missiles. I think that's how you're actually supposed to hit the moles. Get out of it. Alright, let's see. Have I missed anything? I don't think I have. Oh, watch out! See, with Spyro, it's a lot easier to avoid things because, like, you know, you can just jump out of the way. Whereas with Sergeant Bird, he starts flying. Mission accomplished. It's great to have you back, sir. Right, okay. Well, that may be the mission accomplished, however. But in terms of everything that we've done, we haven't finished everything. He didn't even rescue all the birds. Like, what the hell is he doing? All right, like, wait, where the fuck did we even come from? I don't even know where we came from just now. I've lost track of everything. All right, flower pot man, get out of my face. Plunger man, you can also get out of my face. But I have no clue where I've come from just now. Alright, let me just... If I can grab this. I think you can grab these. Yeah, there you go. And then you're supposed to drop them on the... On these. Like so. Oh, I have more all the time. Okay, that's pretty cool. So I'm just gonna like fly around with like these all the time. I think there, there is... Um... Oh, watch out. I believe that there's always uh, something above above you in this that you're always going to miss somehow or another. Like this, for example. And the top of the warehouse that we just come from. Bombs below! I don't think that's the right saying, but whatever. Bombs away! That's the one I was looking for. That is the one I was looking for. Oh, I remember now. So this is how you get them. You have to drop bombs on them constantly. Well, that's... Very good at promoting, you know, what children should be doing at, when they become a, a penguin, I guess. <laughs> Not saying your kid will ever become a penguin, that's just a suggestion, but whatever. So how do I even get in there? Is there like some secret passageway of getting in there, or... I'm probably going to die going through here, most likely, like, knowing my luck. Alright, let's go over it. And then over this one. Oh, watch out! That was kind of close. More? Really? More? Oh, come on. And there you go. Come on, open the door. It's free! He's free! Do I have to talk to him or, or her, rather? Um, just stand there. Alright. You're doing those orders very well. Just carry on. So there's two more. There's two more that we're missing. It's gonna fly through this tunnel, literally. I think they go off at the same time. All right, that's good. So how do I even get into that little glass case bit in there then? There's gotta be some sort of secret passageway somewhere. For now, what I'm gonna do is focus on just getting the gems, in terms of like, you know, killing everyone, and just getting the gems up here and whatnot. And then I'll go for the moles, and then after that I'll go for the hummingbirds. Because I don't feel like it's majorly important right now to go for the hummingbirds because... Well, there's just no point. I don't see the point in it. 
just like for right now anyway, I'll eventually go there, but I don't like that. Like you fly all the way up here just to get the gems to drop all the way back down. Then you've got to come all the way back up and it's just irritating. I mean they couldn't have designed that a little better. That's all I'm asking. Just a little bit of care and consideration, you know? It's just a little bit annoying. Like for example with this. And that one. Alright, I think that's all of them. Oh, there's a hummingbird. Hey, hummingbird. You're free. Go free. Go free. Why aren't your doors opening? Come on. Be serious now. Oh my god. How the hell... How the fuck are you supposed to, like, open it? What the hell? That made no sense. It just stopped randomly. Well, whatever you want to do, I suppose. Oh, I'm all out of sparks. Hey, I need your ladybird health powers of healing. Come here. There you go. Alright, there's one here. Am I missing anything else? Alright, there's a bot. Alright, I'm gonna need this. One for this mole thing here. No, 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 no. Bombs away! And then I'm going to need a, the other one for this thing here. I need to find out how to get into the the room where that hummingbird is. Alright, let's see. So, oh. Okay, I thought that was a purple gem for a second there. I don't know why. Alright, where's the doorway? Is it back up here somewhere, or... I've forgotten where the doorway is. It's over here, I think. I think this is the right one. Alright, no it's not, but it works. Because I got a life from it. I've actually lost the doorway. How did this happen? Can't we just like blast our way through there or I mean is there a certain way that I've got to go to get in there or I don't know, I can't I mean I, I, I can see a door, but Oh my god, I'm so lost. I am so lost right now. Oh wait, is it is it that one over there? Is this where I came from? Alright, I think this is where I came from, which is good. We're making progress slowly. So, I've got to get all the moles, and I've got to get all of the strong chest things. Let's look down. Let's get this guy. I don't think you need to hit him dead on, because it's sort of just, it hits them anyway. Like, the, expl the explosion radius will hit him anyway. That's what you get, you son of a bitch. Oh, what, we don't have any bombs left, really? How many did you even pick up? We gotta go get more? Really? Come on. That's like one big cheap shot right there. Alright. And let's do this. Alright, so we got a couple more bombs. Let's keep going. I think that there's... It's gonna be kind of annoying because there's a mole right next to one of the strong crate things. And also, we still haven't found the entrance way to get to the other hummingbird, so that's kind of annoying. I believe it's in here somewhere, isn't it? The strong crate that we couldn't get to. Oh no, wait, that's a mole. Alright, well never mind about the mole for a second. Let's just see if we can get this first. Bombs away! Oh, okay. Oh, that's really sneaky, that one. Alright, let's get this mole then. Alright. Oh, we got a skill point. Nice. I don't think there are any more moles, but I just want to be sure anyway. I'm not sure if you get like an an egg for doing this, but just in case, you know, I want to check. Uh, hummingbird, ladybird. Okay, so you don't actually get anything. Good. I think that you get about a maximum of four of those bombs at one time. Which would explain things, I guess. Which would explain why I was losing mine, but that's fine. Alright, the last couple of gems and the last egg that you're going to find for this world are down here then. Because this is going to be where we find the last hummingbird and then you'll get another gem for doing this. Get a couple more gems. Alright. Plant Pop Man. I don't know what the hell a Plant Pop Man would be doing down in a lava pit, but... You know, who am I to ask questions? Before I was captured, I recovered this egg from the enemy, sir.
All right. So that's three out of three eggs. That's 62 eggs that we've got in total. I believe that's the last couple of gems. There you go. And level is now complete. So what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to transition and meet you over in uh, Haunted Towers, I believe it's called. I can't remember the name. I believe it's called Haunted Towers or Haunty Towers or something. I'll meet you over at the Sergeant Bird bit and I'll see you there in just a second. Alright, here we are at um, the Sergeant Bird part of the level in Enchanted Towers. I'm ready to patrol the towers and the perimeter of the islands whenever you want me to. It's good to be back in action. Now you see, I don't understand why he has to go into a portal to get control of Sergeant Bird, but I don't know, I guess it's the transition from being Spyro to being Sergeant Bird and stuff like that, so I'm get I guess it makes some kind of sense, but basically, in order to actually get, like obviously you can't do any of the side mission bits here because all the doors will be closed, you can only do them as Spyro, obviously. But in terms of getting all these blue flying things around the place, you're going to need to um, be Sergeant Bird for that because you're not actually going to be able to get all of them just being Spyro. Spyro can get some of them, no doubt, but he can't get all of them. Because you're going to need Sergeant Bird's rockets for this. For example, like that. But if they're in mid-air, then you should be able to just get the... Uh, you should be able to get the gem, like, automatically. Now, what I'm going to do, whenever I hit one of those little floating gem crate things, I'm going to go and get the gem immediately. Because if I go and get... If I go and, like, blast them all out of the sky, then I'm not going to know where I've left them. Which is going to be bad, obviously. And I'm, I, you know, I won't be able to get the full gems for this level, which is going to be even worse. So I'm going to choose to get all of them as I hit them. For example, like this. And then I'll go and get all the blue guys, like, straight afterwards. But I think there's one more gem thing just over here somewhere that I wanted to get. But I can't remember where it's gone. I've lost sight of it. Alright, well I'm going to get the blue guys first then. I believe there is one blue guy that floats around Sergeant Bird's area in this level. I can't remember how many of these we actually got. How many of these blue things we actually got at the time. No, 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 no. Keep flying, keep flying. Alright, where are we? Uh, have we been in here? Possibly. See, it makes me kind of nervous because I know I can hear, like, a Bones person, but I don't know where the hell he is. Maybe up here? Somewhere? No? Or maybe higher? I don't know. Might be higher. Or not. I don't know. They're kind of... Some of them are really hard to find and, like, you know, trying to get to them, but... They've got to be around here somewhere. And they're not... You know, most of them are easy to find, like... This one up here, for example, should be fine to get to. But I think Spyro could get to that one. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Alright, we've got a couple more blue guys. I just want to, like, take care of them first, quickly. Getting the last couple of gems there. I think there's one in this tower here. Oh look, another gem. I knew that I'd miss one somewhere. And then there's one over here. Oh no, it's not. Alright. I've mistaken on that one. Don't worry about what I'm saying. Where did that blue guy go? Oh, there he is. I was just thinking, like, I've lost the blue guy. He was there a second ago. And there's one down here, as I said. You know, there's one that's, like, you know, circling around Sergeant Bird's area. That sounds so wrong. No, 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 keep flying, keep flying, keep flying, keep flying. If you let him drop out too much, he will actually die. Alright, let's see. So I think that the last gem for this level is in this little crate thing here, this little pot. Nope, alright, well, we've obviously missed something then. Alright, so we've been to this tower. What I want to do... Oh, okay, maybe we've missed the guy up here, then maybe that's... Like the gem we haven't got yet. I would believe it is because I don't think Spyro can reach that high, so. Let's get this guy real quick. Okay, maybe not. Uh, you know what? I can't seem to find where the hell this like, last few guys are. They're quite well hidden, I'll give it that. 
I will give it that. You know, they are quite well hidden. Oh, wait, no. Here's the last couple of gems right here. Alright, maybe they're not the last couple of gems. I don't know. They look like... Sometimes they look like they are and sometimes they don't. It's kind of confusing. Can we go around here? I think there's a bone guy around here. Somewhere. Or not. I don't know. This this one is a little bit tricky. It's a little bit tricky. Let's see. So where where exactly am I missing, do you reckon? Where do you suppose I've missed? In the highest towers, so... Let's see. I mean, I've been to most of them. You know what? I'll go find I'll go find the last couple of uh, last couple of guys here, and then I'll show you them when I get there. So I'll see you guys in a minute. All right. So I found one of the guys. He's like you know right at the start of the level, the first tower you're gonna see or go into. He's in here. Cause I heard the guy. I was like traveling through the, like most of the level, and I heard the guy. So all right, that's seven out of eight. So we just need one more, and I'm guessing that's where the last couple of gems are gonna be as well. I've searched most of these towers like in the high points. So I thought what I was going to do next, I might just search, start circling the bottom parts to see if he's like in any of the bottom parts. So I'll go and find the last guy and then I'll meet you over there. Alright, so I found the last one and he's right here. Here, have this. I was going to keep it as a souvenir, but I don't have room in my luggage. <laughs> So the one that I missed was actually right next to the big statue of the sorceress where you blow up the tower. Right next to that My is where it is. is. feeling much better now. Oh no! He started his bone dance again. Oh, here comes the bone dance from Spyro 2. I love this one so much. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Alright, well, I've obviously missed out on a gem somewhere. But, to be honest, I'm not... I don't know, I'm kind of concerned about it, but I'm not overly concerned about it. But, I'm going to search around for a little while, and if I find it, I shall show you where it is. But, until then, I will see you in a moment. Alright, so I couldn't actually find it, which is kind of disappointing, because that means I can't really complete the level fully, but... I mean, we've got all the dragon eggs, and that's kind of all that matters, but, I mean, maybe in future I'll come back, search again, and then I might be able to find it. But for now, I'm going to be moving on back to the home world. Hey now, let's head on over to the Whirly Gig. Alright, so next time we'll be going into the Whirly Gig and facing the next boss, and then we'll be going into, I believe it's called, is it Evening Lake? The next world? But yeah, I, I'm not 100% certain on that, but I will be showing you that in the next episode. So, hope you're looking forward to that. I will be coming back and doing all these little walkthrough guide bits, like, after I completed the game, because that is actually what you need to do in order to get to the end anyway. So, I shall see you all next time. So, other than that, all the stuff to say for me is, I hope you're all having a great day. And please, if you did enjoy the video, please leave it a like, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you all next time. So, other than that, all the stuff to say for me is, farewell!